the video starts, make sure to subscribe, click on the bell so you don't miss an upload, leave a like on the video, and leave a comment down below. Enjoy the video! In this world, apocalypse has fallen. War, disease, and decimation led to a plague that cannot be defeated. A plague of zombies, the dead, risen from the afterlife. While the military attempts to grasp tightly to the ways of the past, Others have begun to live by their own means in this new, forsaken world. The remaining humans must unite together to fight off the infectious dead. And worse, the living. Welcome to Origin Z. Oh, dang walkers. Got guns now. Thought they were dead. I didn't think they'd have a conscience to shoot. God damn. Yeah. Oh god. So many walkers. I got this though. Gonna get me today. Especially ones with guns. Oh no. Oh dang it. Dang it. No. Okay. Gotta backtrack. Got my pistol though. I don't miss, that's for sure. Okay, okay, come on. Come on. Oh, the wonders. They got the ones from the guns first. That yellow one. Oh no, there's more multiple. I gotta get back to the door. But I also can't get the... Oh god, there's more. It's a whole horde. Oh god, this can't be how it ends, right? You know what, that's it! Time for the chocolate! Follow me! You're not gonna get my props today, you zombies! Yeah! Chocolate! Chunkla! <laughs> the power of the Chunkla. Yeah, let's get the rid right of these walkers. Get away, you biters! Take that! Chunkla deck! Oh, that was the power of the flamethrower called Chonkla. Alrighty. And the farm stays another day afloat. Oh. Let's get back in. Get ready for the colonel to get arriving soon. Whew. That was something else. Oh. Dang snakes! You gonna get past me? Another one? Well, this one's kind of cute. Hey there, little fella. How's it going? Nah, dangerous. Ah, dang! 
bit me. Ah. Oh. Oh. Ow. Ow. Ooh. Ah. Oh. Ow. Uh, good afternoon, Brian. Oh. oh, hey there, Kayla. You okay? I heard you having a little bit of a run-in with a snake. Dang snakes keep coming in here. Yeah. They uh, probably realize that it's uh, safe in here. Yeah. Against those biters. <laughs> Bet they don't want to turn into a... Actually, that would be... It. Wait. Have you seen any animals turn into those zombies? Uh, I haven't. Uh, usually when the zombies attack the animals, there's uh, not a whole lot left afterwards. You know oh, yeah, what I that's, mean? That's true. No, you, you definitely got a point there. I do wonder if uh, one was just bitten, what the effects would be. Uh, hopefully we don't have to find out. Well, I grew up with snakes, so they don't really bother me. It's like I'm immune to them or something. They like yeah. just biting. <laughs> Uh, you better watch out, none of the poisonous ones get you. Oh no, I know which ones are the poisonous ones. Okay. Say, how's mm -hmm. Zelda Moe doing for you? Oh, uh, he's doing great. I actually wanted to give him a little bit of hay. He's out uh, over here. Oh, well, hi there, Elder Moe. Long time no see. How are you <laughs> doing, little bud? Thanks so for letting me have him. It's a lot easier having a horse rather than a vehicle. With well, of course, Eltimo is one of the best out here in this farm. <laughs> he is. Uh, so, uh, okay, how are you? Uh, how are you holding up your mother's death? Oh, um, uh, each day is it's getting easier, I guess. Um. Hard to come to terms with, but uh, I guess I'm used to being on my own. So I know how you how you feel when Mom and Pop passed away. It was very hard for me too. I imagine so. Finding them. You had this whole har farm to take care of by yourself. <sighs> it's a lot, but I'm able to do it. Mm -hmm. Especially um, got you since you're tending all the horses in the stable. <laughs> well, I'm happy to help, you know. Apocalypse doesn't change much. Gotta keep on keeping on, you know. Well, yeah, fuel is scarce these days. Mm -hmm. We can't really be dependent on the vehicles anymore, fortunately. Yeah, what fuel we do have should be protecting the crops. Oh, yeah. That's the important thing, is those crops. For sure. And we're the only one left in this region. All the other yeah. farmers died, especially those Jenkins. But they, uh, <laughs> they weren't the brightest fellas, you know? No, they weren't. Mm -mm. The zombies uh, have destroyed what was left of their crops, so... <sighs> we gotta take care of what we have. Thankfully, I've built this electric fence that'll keep them out. Hopefully. Yeah. Hopefully. It's done its job so far, so... Yes, it has. It that way. <sighs> I'm just kind of scared, you know? You never know what might be going on over here these days. Yeah, it's kind of unpredictable, but I think we've managed pretty well thus far. I mean, we've got the farm well taken care of, and we got the people at Safe Haven. Yes. If anything were to happen, I guess we could head over that way, but I think you've done a pretty good job here. I don't imagine we'll have any issues. Well, how? I hope not. I'm neutral. I'll help everybody else, but I'm not on any side. I'll help you, but I'm not on any side. I'm on my own side here in the farm. That's the good thing about you, Brian, because I heard there's some groups out there that. What, I don't what are you about talking about? Else. What groups? I I don't know. Just heard some talk. Hmm. Interesting. Not very uh. Nice, <laughs> to put it simply. Well, maybe we can work with them. I don't know if we want to, but uh, I guess that's well, worth a shot. No, people, people are always in the demand for food, and I got it. The most yeah. of it, that's for sure. That is for sure. Hmm. Maybe the colonel knows about these groups you keep on talking about. 
Maybe. He'd be the one to ask. Hmm. I haven't seen him in a while. But, um... We'll pretty mm-hmm. probably stop him by later today, I think, is the day when he's supposed to come. Oh, really? I believe so. I'll have to stop and say hi if I'm not gone by then. I do have a meeting with the doc later on today. Oh, with the doc. The I doc. haven't met this doc fella yet, though. Well, he's pretty nice. He's uh, working on a cure. Or is he now? Helps. One. Yeah. I have uh, hope. It seems how about like a cure? It seems that all those walker biters zombies are pretty dead, but keep on trying. We'll see, I guess. Um, anyways, I should uh, be heading back to work, get the horses taken care yes, of. Yes, so. yes, please go back to work. I'm going to actually go head back to the farmhouse. All right, I'll, I'll see you around then. Sounds good. See you later, Kay. You too. Dragonfly! What did I say? Get out of here! Go check on him. Hello! Hello? Mm-hmm. Ryan DeVille, is that you? Colonel, what you doing here? Nice to uh, see you. Likewise, my friend. Good to see you're still kicking in the farm. Oh, oh give me one sec. <laughs> Dang rats! <laughs> Glad to see your shot is as perfect as ever. You know me, I don't miss a shot when I see something I want to kill. And that's why we're friends, my friend. <laughs> now, now, like, I'm over here because I just wanted to talk about some supplies. Ah, you know, already ready for a restock? <laughs> yes, sir. Now, what we're you looking on... for this time, Colonel? Well, we're just kind of running low on food. We've already taken up... One new section apparently has about like eight new people, so we're definitely gonna need eight some new, new food. People? Yeah, I went over and took over a building, and all of a sudden, a bunch of these like teenagers popped out of it. But they seem nice. Like, we're gonna have to. We're definitely gonna have to keep a lookout for them. You know, yeah. it's not nice to oh. spy on people. <laughs> what the? Oh, what um, the heck? I, I wasn't. Spying. I, I, uh, Kayla, get over here. What are you doing over there? Hiding <laughs> over there? <laughs> I, I wasn't hiding, a uh, Colonel. <laughs> and um, Nick, seems like you're back from your from your route, perhaps. I am indeed. Uh, indeed. How is it? How is it? It's gonna be trouble sometimes for sure. <sighs> what is that it's, supposed to mean? What's trouble. What's going on? Dozens of what? Dozens of zombies in the way. I'm afraid. Mm-hmm. We're More tr- biters. We're try- yeah, we're trying to clear up some supply routes, and it looks like yeah, uh, we're gonna took have to the, get our hands dirty. Yep. Took oh, the liberty. Uh, took I'm the sure liberty you... of. They are taking up some of them out on the way, but too many for me. But uh, we can just find another route. You don't necessarily have to. Yeah, it's way too perfect for the safe haven. It's just a perfect route straight to here. It's even shorter than the one that we've been taking. For quite some time so? now. Well, yeah. I- I'm sure we could find a way around them. I- it's not necessary to kill them all. I mean, I mean, Doc's working on a cure. He is. Yes, he is. I just checked up on him, actually. He's in the middle of it, but no progress so far, so I'm trying to keep my safe him safe. Well, the more walkers I... that are around, the less safe we are. I understand that, but I mean... I'm sure we can help them somehow. Help them how? They're dead! <laughs> There's no proof backing that. Listen here. Are you listen sure here. about that? Listen here. Kayla, was it? Uh, yeah. Sorry, still a bit new around these parts. Uh, but there's no helping them. Let me, I just say, point and shoot. Simple as that. But, uh, there's, there has to be another way. I, I... I'm sorry to say, Kayla. If I'm able to capture one or two of them, I'll make sure to let you know. But with a horde such as that, I can't just leave that lingering. Well, Who maybe knows? there's something I can do. I, I I get zombies all the time for the dock. Uh, maybe just give me some time. I'll I'll go over there. I'll see for it for myself, and I'll try and do something about it. I mean, one day. One by the day. Way. One day. <clears throat> okay. Uh, um, yes, sir. Sit one down, day. Kay. No. Listen you to have the one colonel. day to try to clear that up. If not, I'm going to be sending my men to take care of the dirty work, including myself. Do I make myself clear? Yes, yeah. sir. You, you do. All right. 
We'll be happy to how... oblige to that command, sir. Thank you. I'm glad. I know how you feel about zombies and the fact that, yes, they might be cured, but we have absolutely no idea if they actually can be cured. Like, like Brian over said here, too. They might already be dead. And I'm taking that precaution already. We gotta protect ourselves. But what happens if that horde came over here and destroyed the crops? No one would have food then! Exactly. I know, but... I, I just think we're really close. I, That's I also some other bad news I have, uh, Colonel. More sir. bad news? Uh, yes. Alright, what is Spill it? Spill the tea. By the, by the way the horde was moving, I'd say they, they are moving towards safe haven. Slow pace, but if they keep continuing that direction, we may have trouble on our hand. Ah, see, exactly what I thought. Well, that's not rude. Right. Okay, Caleb, well, how long do you think we're taking? We're we talking like two days they'll be there? One day? Hours? Uh, at the pace they, are, they have in the road ahead, I'd say a week. A week? Per perfect. So just give me a day and... I'll try and do something. I mean, it would be better if it could be a couple of days. Although the small ones may be able to get there in less than, in less than two days. Wait, there, there's small ones? Yeah, it seems like there's been a lot of them. <sighs> Had to put a couple of them out of their misery. Those are just kids! Listen, yeah. when you when you see a, do a dog that's sick, sick beyond, and on beyond help, what do you do? Do you just let it uh, lie there and die slowly? Or do you put it out of its misery? Well, it depends took, if you can help them. I took the... I took the liberty of putting them out of their misery. Okay. Same time I gave them the order. So if you don't get anyone mad at anybody, it should be me. But those kids, they're not kids anymore. They're ruthless. They're, they're fast, fast. And nimble. And yeah. And then they'll turn that. you into them. Exactly. But what are you doing? Not if you're careful. Well, hey, no okay. funny business here. Nick, Nick, <laughs> Put Nick. the gun away. Nick, you want Don't to attract that horde over here? My K. Don't think that's a great idea. And now everything is gone crazy. All right, put the guns down. Put the guns down. Mine's already down, yes. Colonel. Yes, sir. Sorry. Calm down. Everything's gonna be okay. Remember, Nick, you're on my land, my turf, my rules. I'm gonna God. say, understood. We're, good, we're on good connections here. Brian and I of course, accidentally Kurt. had a, a little hiccup because something like this, I would not be happy. He's the reason why we even have food at the safe haven. So please, be mindful. Okay, Nick? Understood, sir. My Thank apologies. You. Okay. That man is talking with his yes, tongue Colonel. out of his shoe, Colonel. <laughs> Don't worry, it's okay. I'll deal with him later. Um, okay. Like I said, you have a day. I wish I could give you more, but... Like Nick said, two days for the small ones. Yeah, we need to take care of them fast before bad things happen. I'm sorry, Thanks, but that's all I can give you. I understand. Um, mm -hmm. In that case, I uh, better be on my way. Of course, of course. All right, well, be careful, um, Kay. It's a dangerous world out there. Yeah, you guys too. Stay safe. And as for you, Nick, I want yes, you to go sir. back out on that route. I want to see how fast those little ones are going. Roger, sir. I want an accurate reading in two hours. Okay, be safe out there. Well. <sighs> Hello to you too, Brian. If it is my brother, Mario. Hey. It's good to see you too. It's been, what, a week since I last saw you? A week? Boy, it's been a month! How's it been a month? I've been... It's hard to keep track of time when you're, I don't know, trying to survive the undead out there. You're lying like a no-legged dog, Mario. Really? Do you really have to keep up this? The bed is over. You don't have to keep talking like that. What are you talking about, Mario? Oh, whatever. Anyway, I, I just need... I came here for some food. Oh, of course. Please. Just come on by whenever. Mm hmm. Yeah, yeah. Come on inside. Now, have you found anything out there? What's. Tell me what's been up with you. What you been up to? <sighs> Nothing really. The undead are unchanging. Endless swarms. Endless. 
Hordes. Hunger. Yeah, the endless hordes, the less endless food. hunger. Yeah, there's less food. And all the shops I've been ransacking or all the cafes and restaurants I've been trying to get to are just empty. Mm -hmm. Seems like other scavengers have been coming. Ah, I see. Well, the colonel was here earlier. Oh, him, yeah. Dealings with him has been pretty good so far, but... I heard there's a new group arising. Something... I actually... I don't even know the name of them yonders, but... Younger folks. Hmm. I haven't seen or heard of them yet, so... Interesting. I guess... Guess I'll have to keep my blessings on that one. Hmm. Indeed. Anyway, yeah, for the food... I brought you some parts for... For, for some guns. Let me see. Carbon receiver... Interesting. Okay. All right. What else Here's has a, he brought me? There's a stock for a rifle. It might be useful to getting the, the undead off the fence. Okay. And then, of course, I actually ransacked one of those. I was actually able to find some parts for the tractors and all that. In ah, there. yes. This is perfect. Oh, yes. I'm going to be able to fix one of my tractors that's been down for a while. Yeah, and there's a... Some ammo stocks that you may need. SMG, I might have something in the bunker down below. All right, well, thank you so much for bringing this stuff. It actually will help me. Yeah, it wasn't easy. The scavengers have been going crazy with- Oh, nothing scavengers. is easy these days, Mario. It's an apocalypse for a reason. Yeah. Those zombies, just... biters, whatever you want to call them. Are vicious. It was just... Hard to believe just last year I was just getting ready for my training for heading out to military camp and all of a sudden the apocalypse happens. Man. Yeah. Mom and Pop. Yeah. First one of the first to go. Let's not talk about that. But uh, here, here. Uh, I got the food. I got you some bread, some strawberries from the, the field, and... I made you a cherry pie. Well, I didn't make you, actually, I should say. I made myself a cherry pie that I'm going to be giving to you willingly. All right. It's fine. I can make myself another later. I know you probably yeah. need more of the food than I am. I mean, I live on a field right here, as you can see. Yeah, and I'm out in the roads scavenging what I can. Ah, fresh air. I mean, Mario, I told you you could stay here, but I don't know why you want to stay in that god dang truck of yours. It's because it's safer. It's I safer? Mario, have you seen all these electric fences that I put up? Yeah. Remember those wood ones but, that we had when we were younger? Do you see those yes. anymore? It's electric fence. But at the same time, the zombies will eventually pick up where someone is holed up or this and they'll swarm i've seen it happen it almost they almost took me once doing that remember that guy i told you i was with the the only survivor from my squad yeah remember what about I, him do you remember when i told you he messed up he got a swarm to our to our base and they got him they almost got me too if i hadn't got out in that truck it's just not i i just don't feel comfortable right now just staying in place right now I just have to keep moving. If I'm not in the same place for long, the swarm will find me. That makes about as much sense as tits on a bull. That makes no sense. You should just stay here, Mario. Where it's safe. Have you seen the little camps I've set up for the survivors that just are like yonder, like just straggling? I understand, but plus, it, it's just I just don't feel right. Maybe that'll change, but right now I'm just. Feel more comfortable in the truck, moving from place to place. Plus, it's better off if I'm out there at least either thinning out the hordes or at least gathering supplies like the scraps and all that. I don't understand you. That is just a pile of... I don't even want to say. Plus, who's the one that has military training? Out of the two of us, I have the most chance of surviving out there. Excuse me? Do you forget I also went to military school? For like a week. Oh, mom and pop never told you, did they? 
I mean, what? Not that's a conversation for another time if you don't know. Of course, you don't live here, so you don't get to know. I'll tell you later when you decide to come here and live. Yeah, and I don't know when that will ever be. <sighs> but thank you for the food. <sighs> I will My say brother, this. I'm not gonna leave you hanging. But yeah, I also will gotta get this. something out of you know it. Yeah, yeah. I'll bring I'll bring electronic scraps when I find them, especially the ones for the machines here. Oh, you know what, Mario? Since you are out there more than I am, if you find any more fuel, I'll make it worth your wild. Uh, sure. I've been kind of getting worried. We're running low. That's the only thing I have been low in, running low on is fuel. Those yeah. tractors take lots and lots of fuel to even like crop or that seed and get all these dang crops going. Yeah, that's the issue. Even if the, even if there is a gas station that's just empty, a lot of the those rogue scavenger groups, the ones that are not so friendly tend to hold up in them or guard them viciously as they need to fuel themselves for the vehicles. Mm, it's been hard true. enough to find fuel for the truck. I've been I having heard... this Yeah. I've been having I've been having to siphon fuel from like the other trucks from the from those stops, but even that's running low. Well, I'm I did to... hear a rumor that there was uh an off what what is old King it's all that in the water that to get those the gas? Oh god, what is that? You mean the watered down gas? No, 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 no. Like the little, little, the little uh, places that are in like the ocean, picking up the oil. Oh, oil rigs. An oil rig. Yes, thank you. I heard there's an oil rig near the beach that's over here on the other side of town. And I might go we... exploring later on, but if I can get the hold of the, all that gasoline and control that pinpoint, it would mean oh, the world over here. We will be sustaining for a long time if that were to happen. But I can't do that because first I got to get a truck that has the capability of holding gasoline. Plus I got to get a boat. But it's in my to-do list. Yeah. Well, you did, you did talk about that military and make some kind of deal with it. Yeah. I'm... You know how I am, Mario. I like to stay neutral. I don't like to pick sides. It's more beneficial for me, you know, just because, you know, information's also key with the other groups, whoever yeah. may come by later on, no. but... Yeah. Yeah, I get that. Just keep yourself safe. Don't do not do anything dumb, like raising some kind of alarm here. Dumb? Are you, excuse me, Mario? You're the guy who tried to, who tried to learn how to be a rodeo guy. Who wanted to be a rodeo rider? No, I'm pretty sure that was you. No, that was you. That was not me at all, Mario. I wanted to be the bullfighter. You wanted to ride the bulls. Mm-hmm. Uh, whatever. I should get going. You know me. With my gun, I don't miss if I see a target. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, I will say this. Uh, stay out of the south part of town. The Why is that? The horde, the horde, the one I was, I keep, I've been keeping tabs on. Oh, I've been told it, about the horde. It's actually, funnily enough, top. Kayla's gonna be looking over there. She said she was gonna go exploring there for information. Well, not for research purposes. She's trying to find a. The, she has this doctor that I haven't even met yet, but trying to find a cure for the zombies. Uh, well, I don't know if there is a cure for this. That's but what there I is said. One, but if there is one, I hope she finds it. I hope so. But for now, if she's having to heading to that part of town, she's gonna be in trouble. That part is that part is where the horde is right now. There's hundreds. Oh, of she knows right that. There. She knows. Is that why she's traveling there? Yeah, she took one of the horses. Of course she did. All right. If I if I stop by there, I'll see if I can. Please do. I'm not, I'm not sticking my neck out for a stranger. You sure you don't no, want to spend the night here at home? No, 
You know how I am. I'll, I'll get my truck moving, and plus I'm pretty sure you want me to move. Wait. Where did you park your truck? In front of your gates. Absolutely not! That's not a parking spot, Mario! You think any of the homes can park- will be able to accommodate any of this- accommodate that truck? There's only one spot. Is that- that sounds like a personal problem. You're the one wanting to live in that humongous truck and- I don't know why you do. Anyways, well if you're gonna go, you better start going now. I don't know if you attract any biters coming. They're called zombies, they're not called- Zombies, biters, walkers. I've heard the, all the names. I'll give them whatever name I please. Here, I'll walk you to your truck. Yeah, yeah. Things have been oh, looking yeah. tense lately, though. Yeah, there's. It seems like the more we, the more that uh, people wander into this town, the more the undead also seem to follow them. Yeah, it's a bit worrisome. At least we're not in. At least we're not in New York, where I was stationed. That place is just. I long. couldn't even imagine. New York must be. It's a, it's a, it's a high, it's a hornet's nest. There's so many undead there. There's not enough bullets in the world to take them all out. At least out here, there's not that really many. But you know that horde obviously is always moving. Yeah. Honestly, it's it's crazy. But anyway, thank you, Brian. Of course, brother. Please stay safe out there, right? I will, and you do the same. Oh, I will. You don't gotta tell me that. I'm safe up here cooped in the farm with the electric fences. I get it. But you know me. Yes. Anyway. I know you, brother. Yeah, yeah. I'll see you uh, I'll see you next time. Sounds good. Take care. <laughs>